Every significant event in someone's life is shaped by the environment in which it takes place. When people enter into the spaces that Equip designs, we really want them to feel a sense of connectedness and belonging. Architects are notorious for designing projects that clients can't afford, and we're aware of that. And so what we're trying to do is maybe recognize in our industry where some of those shortcomings have been in the past, and then try to transform the experience of architecture moving forward. The reality is most people don't live in the architectural experience every day. They're called to do their jobs. They're called to be pastors or bankers or doctors or whatever it may be, and they're not really familiar with the building and design process. Most architects, their role is to just design. Take what you want, manifest it in drawings, and see that it gets built. What we feel is our job at Equip is to be stewards of the entire process. There's no doubt that Equip has become a partner for us, and one of the primary illustrations of that is we're now in our fifth project with them. When you enter into a project like this, you need trust. You need someone who you know is going to be able to speak honestly. And that's been our consistent experience with Equip. They understand us, our culture, our DNA. And I think the culture that they've created and the culture that we've created have been able to work well together. We always say when we're first getting to know a client, we want to become part of your family. We want to be able to think the way you think because along the way there's a million decisions that have to be made. And so if we integrate ourselves and learn to think the way they think and become part of their family, it just helps us to create a product that feels like it comes from them, that's part of who they are. The buildings and the designs that we do need to be a reflection of the culture, DNA, and vision of our clients. The client really is the hero of the project because at the end of the day, they're the ones that have the vision that we bring the design to. And so building around that is really where a facility takes shape in a meaningful way. This is hard. Everybody wants to build more than they can afford. Everybody wants to design, you know, the greatest thing ever. And that's not always possible. But when you've got people that are helping you come up with creative solutions, the team at Equip has just been incredible. Some of the most important steps that you can take when you're designing an environment for really anybody is to think through what do we want the end user to, to fully experience, whether it's a sense of security or cleanliness or transparency. We've got to think through the needs of the end user and design around those. For us, it's a lot about having a team approach, people who can speak into their given areas of expertise we're very collaborative. At Equip, no one works in a silo. We really approach every problem as a team. It's super important for me to work with an organization that has an established culture. Part of the reasons that gives me confidence is because I know in the future, as they add new teammates, those teammates are going to incorporate into that culture as well. The culture at Equip just fosters uh, really getting to know each other on a deeper level. I feel like we're all very open. We really try to help each other improve. And I'm just blown away by even our youngest employees and how eager they are to learn and to bring everything they have to their projects and to our clients. Typically, the architectural industry has a lot of high turnover. We don't. The reality is if you have a project that's going to take months, if not years, you want to have consistency across that team. What you don't want is a team member leaving halfway through. We do like the idea that the team that's going to be assigned to your project is going to be there not only for your project, but probably for the next project as well. It's such a sense of comfort to know that we don't just have an architect, we don't just have a designer, we have a partner, someone that we trust. My ultimate hope for our clients is that when they look back on the process and the experience of designing a building, that they look back and say, that could not have gone any better. But at the end of the day, I really hope that whatever organization is that we're working with, that they're better off than they were before. We knew that they could handle this. We knew that they had the kind of team that could come in and make this project excellent, and they did and now to be in these spaces and to see people interact with them every single week, it's just a joy. I mean, it's true delight to know that what they put on paper way back has become a reality.